Oh boy. How's it going everyone? My goodness gracious. We're off to a start here already with the chat. What is going on everyone? Goodness gracious. Are you able to send me a friend request on a fishing plan? I don't know. I'll have to try, Sharon. I honestly don't know. I was over here. I was shooting arrows at a freaking bison 290 yards away. I would just like aim up in the air and shoot. And then I'd like try to see what would happen. The bison would just be standing there like wondering what's going on too. I don't, I don't even know where the arrows landed. I have no idea. I could see where they would land in the water short. But when I aimed up higher, I had no idea. Anywho, we're going to be hopping multiplayer servers today. So if you are out there playing and you want to join in, uh, feel free. Uh, just pay attention to where I'm hopping to because once I hop in there, there's no way I'm going to remember their name. So, uh, so yeah, just, just try that out. What, who all do we have in the chat today? My goodness gracious, Hook and Hogs with Henry is here. William Tyler was off to the races with Logan Linton there. That was fun. Uh, Ruined Grenade is here. Brandon Hayes, Shadow29, The Hunter 780, Smash the Trash is here, Fishing with Nelson. David Probus, hey, what's up, David? David, Clayton Subweb is here. Good deal. Sharon Wrist, well done. Well, we're doing, we're doing all right. We're doing all right, everyone. Well, like I said, we're starting off with the Hunter Call of the Wild. Um, I'll have all of you help out with this because I'm sure there's tons of people who will show up. I, by tons, I mean between one and five people who will show up and say, when are you going to play Fishing Planet? When are you playing Hunter Call of the Wild? You know, when we switch to Fishing Planet, that's of course when people will show up and, uh, and, and say, hey, when are you doing hun the Hunter Call of the Wild? Um, so, you know, just watch that too. Um, but yeah, I think it's time to, uh, just have some fun. I think we'll see. We'll see. I can't tell if the chat has frozen or, or what is going on. <laughs> I think I'm going to close. I'm going to close the chat because it all of a sudden just stopped doing stuff. Here we go. Here we go. There we go. That's better. Now I can see people. Now I can see people. Shadow 29, you're too nice, man. You're too nice. Well, cool. Top notch. Let's uh, let's get started. I think where where should we go today? Silver Ridge Peaks Warlord Sully Gaming .com server. My God, what a name! Silver Ridge Peaks. There. There's only two people there. There's two people in Yukon Valley. That could be kind of fun. Especially if we could find some bison, that'd be a fun time. Leighton Lake, two of eight there. Silver Ridge again with one of eight. Um, yeah, mum, 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 mum. Let's uh, let's try Yukon. I haven't hunted in the Yukon in a while, and that sound if if we can connect anyway. Who knows? Who knows if we can connect? That's always the trick, right? You find a you find a multiplayer server that looks fun, and then you have trouble connecting to it. You know, never fails. Oh, it's dark. Why does it always have to be dark, huh? Well, I'm not getting the uh, the night vision stuff out. I'm not. I swear. I swear I'm not going to. What are they all doing over there? Um, tell you what we could try to do, though. Could try to find some, uh, some good old wolves. If we could find some wolves, that would be kind of fun to do at nighttime. You lost this game and it made you mad. My goodness. Well, that would make me mad too, man. Let's uh let's try to find some wolves real quick and if we can't find any wolves around here then we'll uh we'll switch to a different map. Hi Sharon. Got it for 5 bucks. Yeah, that's a good deal. Because we are in a big storm. Logan Linton, sending good vibes your way, bro. Hope everything works out. I'm sure you're taking necessary precautions. Werewolves, Bo. Werewolves. Oof. Hopefully not. Hopefully just... I mean, it is it, almost a full moon. Otherwise, I would be worried, David. I would be worried, David. Not seeing anything so far. We will see.
could I play? I'm on console. You could certainly play, just not with not with me, unfortunately. <laughs> but hey. Top notch. <sighs> what is everyone doing? How is your uh, how is your today's Monday, right? Today's Monday, right? I don't even know what day it is, dude. It is Monday, because we're doing our Monday stream, of course. Goodness gracious. Do you, do you feel that? Do you get into that vibe where it's just like these days just kind of meld together? You don't even know what day it is anymore. Goodness gracious. I'm just running. Oh, there he goes. He switched time on us. Called it. I called this place. No one else can go there. By the power of me, I will give you a wolf. <laughs> well, thank you. Fortunately, they switched times on this, so now we're now we're up on top of Copper Rust Line Ridge. Watch this find like a actually I'm running it. I'm running low on arrows, so we might as well we might as well get some. You're gonna carp fish? Well right on, man. I love carp fishing. I love carp fishing. Don't wanna run out of these bad boys. Seven hundred grain broadheads. I never have enough 700 grain broadheads. It's my trick for the trade. Oh, we have a handgun with us. How about that? Hello, caribou. Nice little four to start out. Car fishing, a my hunting trip. I don't think I did 780. Uh, well, actually, I read it and it didn't. My dad and I went hunting this week and he shot a bear. We swore we heard the distinctive slab and we never found a dead bear. Well, gosh darn it, man. That sucks. We have a small caribou. Caribos. We have two caribos over yonder. Oh, there's more of them. Didn't even see you all down there. Oh, now he's walking. Bison, bison. Uh, all right, top notch. Well, two Karibos down. Nothing special. Nothing to write home about. But hopefully, we'll head on over to the other uh, watering hole over there and see if we can find anything down in that direction. <sighs> With this dog on head cold, going back to work tomorrow. Oh no. Oh no, David. Well, I mean, uh, share if if you want to. If you don't want to, then don't don't worry about it, David. But what what do you, what do you do? What sort of work do you do, David? Oh, calls dibs. I had a popper and a heron. I was slaying like ten thousand in five minutes. Well, goodness gracious, goodness gracious. Yeah, now I, and someone actually said the other day that I recommend not going to Naharan, and I was like, what? What? Why would you recommend not going to Naharan? If you're if you're leveling up, then I would definitely do that. Definitely do that. Okay, so we got a bison over there, not very big. Very that's not good. That's not good. Okay, well we'll go grab this caribou real quick and then we'll uh Move on. Who disliked the stream? Probably someone that we timed out. We timed out like three people, four people already. I mean, the stream like literally started and like even when it when it was counting down, we 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 timed out like four different people. So I'm surprised we only have one dislike, to be honest. <laughs> Some people just like to show up and just ruin things. It's amazing. Mr. Man, what is up, my man? What is up, Mr. Man? Not a whole, not a whole lot. Dancing Eagle, I never said hello to you, but hello. Going halibut fishing. Well, that's cool. Good luck, man. That sounds awesome. Halibut fishing. 
They should leave. <laughs> what do you think the next map is going to be? My money is on Australia. We shall see. Of course, I would have probably put my money on Australia last last time when they put out those Rocky Balboa gloves. But uh, I do think that this time around, that's what we're going to be looking at. But uh, we shall see, right? What the fun is about. Where's the blood for this guy? Come on, man. I'm a library citizen at the Bible College where I graduate here in NC. I help students with research and such. Well, that's awesome, man. That is cool. That is cool. Oh. Oh, no, man. Looking for blood. Where's the blood? What's in the blood? Is the tracks going this way? Moose tracks? That just makes me think of ice cream. Now I want ice cream. See what it'll be. Hello, BZ. How's it going? What is up, the watcher? To level up, I'm four, but should I use worms or cro for crappie or spoons? You know, I don't know. Every time I've caught a crappie in Fishing Planet, I wasn't trying to. Um, I was just trying to catch other fish, and the crappie came and, and bit it anyway. So, um, I honestly have no idea. That is a good question. Zach, go get us ice cream. He's in class right now, unfortunately. <laughs> He'll be joining us around 9, though, hopefully. You gonna t you you gonna turn around or you just gonna keep fleeing? So he's nervous now. But I figured he would turn, but he hasn't turned yet. Oh, thought we could sail a second one into him. That way we didn't have to chase him down. But no. I'm sure there's blood down there, but I really don't feel like finding that other caribou. I hear a Bjorn dog barking. <sighs> Gonna go deer hunting this upcoming deer. Well, right on, man. Rocky Road. I don't know, Monge Life. I don't don't remember you getting timed out. To loot a 308, they need to loot a 308 and 300 short mag, ultra mag, because why not? Because why not? <laughs> yeah. I agree, Axis Deer do live in Australia in real life, and they are the next true rack. Yeah. See, that's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking if, if they're creating a map right now to be the next DLC, and uh, one of the animals that's already in the game um, is already is going to be in that in that map, and they're already creating all the true rack animals for that map, um, and they're making the true rack animal for this one. I mean, they might as well put it in the game right now so that we don't have to wait for it. Um, if that 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 uh, <laughs> explanation made any sense whatsoever, then uh, yeah. Not Ben and Jer not Ben and Jerry's. Uh, Tan Tan, don't say my name, bro. Fishing plan and abandon the fishermen. Trying to grind since that game actually gets new lakes and stuff. Yeah, unfortunately, gosh darn it. I, you know, I honestly thought about putting a video out about that, but I wondered what Fishing Planet would think about it. I don't want them to get mad at me. <laughs> Not send me any DLCs and stuff, you know? Trying to remain on their good side. At the same time, still informing people not to buy the fishermen. <laughs> Which, I mean, yeah, it goes, it goes both ways. When it comes to those darn publishers and stuff like that, it, it makes you wonder how much the developer, like, has any say about it, you know? 
because obviously they're making new content for Fishing Planet. You know, what is going on between the developer and the publisher if they're already making updates, but for some reason it's just not going into the fishermen? It seems like there's got to be some sort of fault on the side of the publisher when that's happening. So, I don't know. You should call your channel the Outdoors Hub. Yeah, but we're BZ Hub. Don't you see? What's better, the Outdoors or BZ? Well, tell you what. <laughs> me and Zach, me and Zach are pretty cool and we're in the outdoors. So, I mean, you're basically getting two for the price of one, right? You're getting outdoors plus you're getting us with BZ Hub. So, kind of, you know, it's like a package deal. <laughs> squish, squish, squish. And Matt is here. Well done. It hasn't looking at the beta group. Also, where's Squish? Oh god, oh god, I missed it. He said that you added him into a Snapchat group. Your boy's not dead. Well, that's good. <laughs> Oh, it's a good size four there. It's a pretty one. Every time you see those antlers and you're like, oh, oh, oh and then you're like, yeah. Then you see it's only a four and it's like, eh, eh, less impressive, but I still want you. Nothing too great out of that herd. So we'll have to grab this four. Keep going on from there. Lengthier hat, how's it going? <laughs> good. Good, good, good. Oh, there's another herd on down this way. Oh, wow, that's a big herd. It is so snowy right now. Can you hear the Bjorn dog? The Bjorn dog in the background? I swear, I don't know what's going on. But the chat keeps freezing. Blowing in the house. Just have fun, 69. Hey, thank you so much for the $2. That's amazing, man. Really appreciate it. That's awesome. Hope you're doing well. We gotta find this darn caribou. Sorry, I didn't see it at first. The darn... <laughs> the darn chat has frozen twice so far. It's crazy. All three over there. Alright. Yeah, look at that. That's not bad for a little four. I think anyway pretty antlers 348 still far away off from 430 those darn shovels on the front always ruin it always ruin the score no fishing today no there's definitely fishing today at uh at 830 definitely fishing today at 830 can't wait to get a White Moose Lake eventually. White Moose Lake is fun. I, I agree. It is a fun place. Um, catching those big lake trout, you know, it's kind of like, without any DLCs, the, the lake trout are kind of like the first fish that are like actual like giant, you know, like 40 some pounds. Um, yeah, it's pretty awesome. What map is this, BZ? This is the Yukon, man. This is the Yukon. 
The, the, the chat is delayed for you quite a bit, it seems, Bo. Well, like I said, the chat keeps freezing. The chat keeps keeps freezing for some reason. Um, I think we might switch to a different map now. Gave your friend a diamond pronghorn today. Well, cool. Knocked him dead. Knocked him dead. How's it going? People, people, hi. How's it going? Are you going to play Fishing Planet? Yes, indeed. Around 8.30. That why the chat is misbehaving? No, I'm not. That's the, that is the crazy thing. I don't know why it's not. It's being a little crazy, though. It is being crazy. Uh, ooh, John Wayne? John Wayne is here. We're gonna go see John Wayne. That gold caribou. <laughs> Level A, we'll ride on. Left your account for a year? Yeah, that happens. Don't understand how to play it. Hey, well, I tell you what, if you don't understand how to play it, my beginner series is a good place to start uh, picking things up again, I guess. Go check it out and uh, and just follow along, you know. <laughs> it's the best thing I could recommend, at least just to give you a little kind of roadmap for what I was doing anyway. Lucas Roofer. Hopefully I said that right. What's your favorite true rack animal? That's a good question. Favorite true rack animal? Uh, golly, man. Mm, I'm not really sure. Uh, you know, I, I guess I, I do enjoy... Um, a lot of the antlers that they have for red deer. Um, I wish they would have approached it a little bit differently. Um, you know, cause uh, some of the antlers look really cool, but you can only get them on a level seven red deer. And so it's like, it's like they said, you know, oh, we drew, we drew these antlers from inspirations from all over the world. And it's like, yeah, that, I mean, that's cool. That's cool and all. But, uh, you know, I wish that I could get, um, you know, the level seven that's really wide and almost looks like a moose antler because it's just, it's got so much like palm almost. Um, you know, I wish I could get a diamond that looked like that, you know, um, those are really cool and you can't get that. So I like the red deer, but at the same time, I don't like the red deer, I guess. How's that for an explanation? <laughs> Zachary Wheat got his first pronghorn oh, right on, man. That's awesome. Fishing Planet Channel, yeah, for sure. Gives a little bit of an advantage, I love it, because you can see the animals easier. Yeah, very true, David. Very true. Whoa, do you see that? Bounced off that rock. Well, that's one of the fours, anyway. One of them is running out towards me. The other one is not. Well, thanks. Big Rack Diamond Mule Deer are awesome. Oh, yeah. There's something else. You know, I really did like the... Uh, I like the look of the level 5 Mule Deer um, originally. But ever since then, and them kind of changing to level 6s and stuff... I'm not really sure what to think of it. Oh my golly. <laughs> he is spinning around. I'm a person and you can't prove that I'm not a person. Right on Ann Stevens. <laughs> Do you have any hunts this year? No. If you watch my hunting FAQ video, I don't really hunt anymore. Used to hunt a lot when I was younger, not so much anymore. You out for demands again. Going to have a rough time. Rough time.
Diamond Mule Deer looks cool to me, but all under that looks bad be before they got true racks. Yeah, un uh, everything underneath the Diamond Mule Deer. I get you. Yeah. I gotcha. Probably wouldn't even have messed with this guy unless I knew he was going to land in the water and then I wouldn't have to chase after. There's some small, small elk over there. Let's run over here. We're going to check a few different spots and then we'll run. We'll go somewhere else. BZ bounce, bounce. Very true. That, that rock was very bouncy. I think it's a rubber rock. We just didn't know about it. Squirrely mountain goat, indeed. Nice shot. Hey, well, thank you. Only took me three tries. <laughs> There's another one. Oh, it's a kitty cat. Hello, kitty cat. Turkeys. We honestly don't even have anything to shoot a turkey, I don't think. Whoa, what the heck, man? All I did was go down a rocky little face there. Not a big deal. Jeff Bendick, hey, no trouble, man. No trouble at all. How did your first tournament go? You know, I think after after all the time went by, I think we ended up placing 27th. Sharon says she wants to create a server but doesn't know what map we want to play on. Uh, I honestly don't even care. I'm just I'm just running around. Um, I guess you could open up a Verhonga server. I'd run around Verhonga for a little bit, but I don't know. Only have another half hour. Um, but anyway, yeah, after the entire thing went by, um, I think we ended up getting 27th, so not amazing. That was Remy Warren Rock. He finally got back at us. He hurt us after all this time. <laughs> so, uh, so yeah, 27 that did not get us anything. I will say, whoa, goodness gracious, calm down. What are you doing? Don't mess with me. You draw your bow back further, he nil. Faster, I mean, not further. Maybe we could have got one of those. But you were so slow that we didn't get anything. There's a level three. Ah. If you don't know this, I have a curse when it comes to Bighorn. I only see level threes. <clears throat> have any of you guys played Microsoft Flight Simulator? Seems like it might need a good PC. I think I've heard that. I think I've heard things about it, you know, requiring a ton of graphics uh, power, I guess. It's an easy way to surmise it, but... But yeah, something about running it on a, a G or an RTX 3080. Is it 2080? 3080 is the one coming out. The 2080, the RTX 2080, like even then it wasn't like doing fantastic. So it's interesting. Um, I am interested to see these 3080s, these RTX 3080s coming out because they look... They look really good, and they're not very... I mean, they are expensive, don't get me wrong. But, I mean, for the power they put out, seems like a pretty good price. I think they said it would be $600 or something like that. And the base model was going to be, like, just as strong as a 2080 Ti, basically. Like, that's ridiculous. The same three games over and over again. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that. I mean, look at me. You think I'm someone who plays the same three games over and over and over again? Oh, it's something over there. Oh, it's a mule deer. It looked like a mule deer when I was running with the antlers. 
Uh, no, Clayton. I'm not going to. I'm not going to fish at the Tiber River because I've already said I'm going to fish at Saint Croix in the description, and I'm not going to restart a game. Um, unfortunately, I've said it many times before. I'm not going to restart Fishing Planet on on the Microsoft Store. So <clears throat> that's probably why it was deleted. J.A. Crispy, how's everyone doing tonight? I'm doing well. I can't speak for everyone, though. I hope everyone else is doing okay. Three days ago, I got a 10-point whitetail for youth hunting in my uncle's backyard with a hard shot. Well, my goodness gracious. Good shot. That's a pretty decent buck to start out with. I think I think that is right, Tintin. Can we do Nigeria on Fishing Planet? No, unfortunately, no Nigeria. Don't believe. Actually, uh, what is that one that goes way over? There is one in the Middle East, I think, but not Nigeria. I wish they would add some African maps. That would be really cool. Go after a Nile perch or something like that, or a big old tiger fish. Like, that'd be sick. It seems like they're attacking um, South America right now. They're adding maps from South America, um, and I I'm assuming that they're they've they've just put out the Bolivian map, and I'm assuming they're going to put out a another map. That's a pretty decent one. Oh, just gonna lay down, huh? <laughs> Missed ya. Missed ya. Have you played Bolivia yet? No. No, but I'm only level 40. Bolivia is what? Level 58? Something like that? It's a it's a long way out there. It'll be a while before I fish there. Um, if you paid for the DLC, I think it's on sale right now too. For maybe like 30 bucks or something like that. If you paid for that, it would give you a pawn pass to fish there, but I just don't. I don't do that. <laughs> Bring the 70 pound rod and catch the musky golem. No, not catching any monster fish till Halloween. Spread the word everyone so that everyone knows it's become a frequently asked question, <laughs> catching the monster fish. And I keep saying monster fish, monster time, Halloween. It makes sense, doesn't it? That's why we're saving it for Halloween time. So, uh, so yeah. They should put a Brazilian map. Well, they have they have Brazilian maps in Fishing Planet, but they don't have one for the Hunter Call of the Wild. Can I play the Hunter Call of the Wild with you? Absolutely. Right now, I mean, we're we're uh Sorry. I usually hate shooting turkeys with 22, but it was right there. It was right there. Woo woo, woo woo, 388, a long ways, 100 points away from a diamond, my god. Watch this turkey be a diamond. It hasn't come to console yet, unfortunately. Darn it, darn it all. Hey you turkey. So I'm going to re-download Knights of the Old Republic, and I'm doing another playthrough of the oldie but goodie. Ooh. That's one of those I started it one time and never finished it, Knights of the Old Republic. <clears throat> but I remember my uh, my best friend growing up loved that game. Diamond level 5 Axis Deer. Well, right on, man. That's something I haven't even done. I honestly haven't even spent much time chasing after Axis Deer, so that might be something I'll have to do. Um... <laughs> Obviously, because they're going to be putting out the true rack soon. 
There's a mule, eh? Xbox sounds like a printer that's not printing anything while it downloads Forza. It's almost like a, a uh, old internet router. Fishing a giant peacock bass and, and other monsters. Yeah, I mean, they have that right now anyway. Um, right now in the game, they've, they've got a lot of, uh, well, they've got two different, I actually, the one is in Bolivia, but right. But anyway, but yeah, kind of doing some South American fishing places at the moment. See if we can see anything around this turkey. There's a turkey. There's a bear, two bears. Two level two bears, and there's a third bear too. What are you? See you, I just can't spot you. Oh, there's a third bear, a fourth bear. Oh my gosh. Turkey. As best as I'm somewhat early. <laughs> yeah, you're here. Cody Metcalf, how's it going? Oh, it says outdoors with JB. I went to my grandma's house over the weekend. She lives in the county. So I picked up some corn. So I road, took the kernels off, put the corn in my backyard with trail camera. Uh, well, right on, man. Yeah, I mean, if you live uh, near this time of year, if you need, if you live near like a grain silo or anything like that, um, some of the trains will sometimes like uh, leave a trail of corn. You could go out there and just obviously be discreet about it, but pick up just buckets of corn off the ground that way is what we used to do. I mean, it's going to get eaten by a wild animal somewhere, so might as well pick it up and feed it to the wild animals you're targeting, I suppose. Can you see this Colton DeCamilla? Of course I can, man. Of course I can. What's up, turkey? Okay, we're moving on. Moving on. We're, we're, we're going through this pretty quickly. I'm just checking out things real quick, and then we're moving servers. What's your favorite fish to catch in Fishing Planet? Um, I mean, at the moment, I'm sure it might change later on. But uh, I think the largemouth bass are a lot of fun. I mean, they're just, they're constant. Just constant. Throw a frog out, catch a largemouth bass. Throw a buzzbait out, catch a largemouth bass. Um, Everglades is just a ton of fun. And before the Everglades, it was in the Heron. Small mouth and large mouth just constantly. Every, every cast almost. And yeah, I mean, it was just, yeah, it's really fun. It was just a ton of fun. Forza Horizon. Yeah. I remember playing the regular Forza Motorsports. Um, before Horizon came out. I enjoyed those. A little bit of car customization, a lot of racing, a lot of racing. There's a turkey, another turkey. Oh, another turkey. Lots of turkeys. There's nothing out in this open meadow. That's kind of crazy. I used to always seeing something out here. Okay, we're going to check this spot, and then we're going to move on. Unless something else is good. You ever hung up? Okay, right on. So I play fishing plan, and I never catch a fish. Well, what's going on, man? Where are you Where are you fishing? I mate. Bloody crikey. Bloody crikey, mate. Riley Junker. About three months ago, I shot a diamond albino axis deer. My friends say I like axis too much. Evidently. Goodness gracious. Well, that's that's quite a trophy, though. RM Fast Ballers, will they make a fishing game? What do you what do you mean, man? What will who make a fishing game? EW or what? What's your favorite game of all time? Oof. I don't know. I mean, technically, I think if we like think about the games that I've played the most of, um, I mean, I've, I've beaten, uh, Fable 2, Skyrim, and Fallout 
for each of them like three times. Um, so those are some of my favorite games. Um, I don't know. I think it, just for nostalgia's sake, I would think that Skyrim will probably be my favorite game just because I remember, I remember going out at midnight. Goodness gracious, are you kidding me? <laughs> what is going on here? The bears and the turkeys are preparing for war, I think. I remember going out at midnight um, to, to receive Skyrim. And uh, and that was my senior year of uh, well maybe it wasn't no it was my uh, it was my junior year of high school it was the first time my parents let me stay out outside of the house after you know after midnight um, to to get Skyrim I mean that's just a crazy memory I'll never forget it and so Skyrim always has kind of a a nostalgic place in my heart. Fable is such a great series. You know, I you know, I I thought the first one was fun. It's funny because I played it out of order. I played the the second one first, played the first one, and then went to the third one after that. Or uh, no, I played the second one, the third one, and then the first one after that. And um, and I still I still think I enjoyed the second one more than the other ones, but. Fable 3 was not as good as Fable 1. So in my order, Fable 2, Fable 1, Fable 3. That's personally how I order it anyway. Well, they make a fishing call a lot because they that would be great. Well, I mean, they put out a survey about that. You, if you've seen that video I put out, um, it kind of made it seem like they were kind of um, leading us towards maybe a fishing game in the future or at least seeing what people would think about it, so... You fish at the noob area? Okay. I would try a casting spoon. A little easy bass setup and a casting spoon, man. Well, I'll tell you what, I think we're just gonna get rid of some bears for this guy. Boy, if you could set up a tripod here, you would, uh... You would have a time, wouldn't you? Look at them all go. Oh, shot in front of him. Dang it. I was hesitant to shoot any of them just because we had shot three of them and I didn't want them... Didn't want three of them to die and then another one to die and then we would have four dead and then I would wipe out the need zone, so... I was hesitant to keep shooting. <laughs> Henry, how's it going, man? How do I play with you on the Hunter Call of the Wild? You know, honestly, at this point, I mean, just join in on the multiplayer servers that we, uh, that we're joining in on. Draw your bow. Don't know how that first shot wasn't a good shot. How was the second shot not a good shot either? You're driving me insane. one bear oof okay we need to stop shooting things <laughs> we've uh we've reached the maximum albino raven and jeep is here we'll ride on man We got we got arrows on the ground. Arrows on the ground. Where's the blood? Where is the blood? There's blood. Got the right tracks? Yeah, we do.
What the heck? This isn't helpful whatsoever. Good golly. So many tracks everywhere. It's making it difficult to figure out where things are. Okay, this is wasting too much time. We're gonna leave. <sighs> Help me out, please. Um, we don't don't really do that. I can say that you can you can watch my beginner series and try to try to uh, figure out things to do in that, but I can't I can't just go to Lone Star. I mean, we were at Lone Star the other day, but uh, yeah. That's what I can recommend. Watch the beginner series and, and try to try to do something similar. Sharon Wrist. There we go. There we go. Straight to the butthole. Indeed. <laughs> Gotta get some doves before the season ends. I would say, whoa, we just took off running there. Hello, Sharon. 7.36 in the morning. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. I think we're gonna switch out our uh, bow. Got that Texas heart shot in the indeed. Uh... Don't need that. Don't need that. Need that. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Da 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 da. Okay, we're good to go now. Sharon is so excited that we're on her map finally. That is what I'm talking about. Until she said hi. What well, map and server? Right now we're on um oh s.ris server in Verhanga. S S Ris.2016 right now. What games you play though? Uh we play the Hunter Call of the Wild, Fishing Planet, Hunting Simulator 2, and others. Just depends on what day. Jurassic World Evolution at the t at the moment. Killer caught six trophy crappie and two uniques on it today and was doing a stream. Killer man. Yeah. That's what and when I was at Lone Star, even going into Mudwater, the casting spoon is pretty much all I threw. It was very boring, but I mean it worked. It worked. Who do just a 201 though that one's a bigger one oh don't turn bud Where'd the other one go There she goes. I have no idea where that other kudu went. <laughs> it was standing out there in the open. How did we lose it? Dylan Frazenhan. Get any diamonds yet? No. No, no, no. Whoa, whoa, wow, wow. Hey, maybe, maybe any animal we shoot will come back as a diamond.
You are my fire, my one desire. <laughs> Zachary, we, what did you miss? Not a whole lot. We've just been kind of running around on different servers trying to find some decent sized animals. How much more than that? You play Fortnite? No, do not play Fortnite. What did you think of the first fishing planet comp? You know, honestly, I think, um, for one thing, like I wish, um, if I could have hit level 40, I think I could have got that 42 pound, like, uh, the drag reel, which I think would have helped get those fish in faster, which would have maybe given me a better chance of catching more fish. Um, otherwise, honestly, I, I don't think... I mean, I've caught big fish doing exactly what the way I was doing it. Um, it's just more figuring out more efficient ways to do it, I suppose. I'll take it. I just like it when they fall like that. It's pretty. 27.4, not close enough to 32.3 to mount it, but hey, still pretty, pretty kudu. I see a spring balk. We'll get some spring block there. Just a fishing plant. It's my bedtime. Oh my gosh. Well, oh gosh, dang it. 8.30 is your bedtime? Believe me when I say I want it that way. Wait some more. Hey, there's nothing wrong with the Backstreet Boys, man. Nothing wrong with them. Fork knife to me in class and he said it, he had the season two tier five veggie skin. I don't know what any of that means, but it sounds cool. Just caught a trophy bass. Well, it sounds like you're doing okay now, man. You're basically Nick, huh, David? Are you Nick? Are you Nick, David? Is that your secret, David? You're actually Nick, you're not David. You know, my friend were casually fishing and I said that feels like a big fish when he started peeling dragon and started yelling. He knew why once saw a 70 pound king, 75 pound king salmon. That's awesome, man. I mean, yeah, that's what I needed. That's what I would have needed for, uh, for that competition. Basically the guy who won it caught a 71 pound king salmon. So, see, so, yep, 75 pounds would have, would have definitely won it. Cleansed. When you play open mics, what? Open mics? Nine thirty is your time right now. I got you, man. Experiencing difficulties, is the stream really slow or something? You're a music man. You are, you are the music man. Man, I'm experiencing difficulties too, can't even click on things. Still watch secretly. Trying to accomplish a thing. Oh, okay. I got you. I got you. Three minutes left in this Call of the Wild stream. Oh, what are we going to find? Anything? Anything? This is always a strange spot because sometimes you'll find something good and sometimes not. I've found a couple of uh, 
couple of di diamond wildebeest actually over here. Just like, just standing out in the open over here. Just for no real apparent reason. Um, diamond wildebeest just standing there. Um, but we actually shot a level five Gemsbok over there as well the other day. So, decent place evidently. Nothing today though, nothing today. Let's, um, this has already got some hunting pressure over here, but we're gonna go run over here and see. Just got a 394 scoring Diamond Roosevelt Elk. Well, right on, Lucas, that's a good one, man. I think anyway, honestly, I have no idea. Ever since we switched from the uh, 1000 score, I have no idea what's a good thing and what's not. As long as it says Diamond, I'm like, okay, yeah, that's a, that's a good one. <laughs> you could say, 392 diamond and I'd be like oh, oh yes okay 185 diamond oh ooh. what I'd have no idea oh as best as gonna head out okay sounds good man eat that cheese bro fish beware <laughs> Bo is coming for you Dylan Dylan Rosler how's it going What time do you want to set it? Oh, no big deal. We're going to have to switch out of here in just a second anyway, Sharon. Don't worry about it. I see some gemmy boys. And I hear angly warthog. Angly, angly. Angry warthogs. Wolf. What was that? That was that wildebeest. Just a single wildebeest out here. Yeah, not too bad. Time to switch, boys. Hey, very true. Let's go check out this spot real quick. Make sure there's nothing, nothing amazing over here on the other side. Diamond. Biggest diamond gold gemsbok ever that would be something diamond gold gemsbok okay i think we're good we're switching everyone we're switching scully 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 Oh, there's nothing there now. Nothing there. We'll switch to this. Until we get it up. You know what switching to fishing planet means, don't you? Super loud music. Do do do. I always like it when we go to Fishing Planet. Cause I always feel awkward listening to music on hunting the Hunter Call of the Wild. For a while there, I had a guy who continually just like he would go onto every one of my videos and comment down below that uh, that he wasn't feeling the immersion. He he. The music was throwing him off and he couldn't he couldn't listen to what I was saying because of the music and uh, and so I, I guess I would have to just take out all the music and all of my videos and everything to please this one dude and I was like okay man I can't do it <laughs> squish flint what is going on here oh no we missed it just a, just a second squish squish I got I got to help I got to do this. We were on the wrong thing. Uh I think it's this one.
Well, there we go. It didn't even tell the, say the amount. Squish, th thank you so much. You're amazing. You, you make every stream more fun. Everyone enjoys having you here. And it's your last stream before going back to work. Oh my goodness. Easily been one of the best things to happen during your leave. Ugh. Well, you've made it awesome. For sure. Number five killed your brother. I forgot about that. Part. <laughs> I know what you're talking about. Just got a diamond mountain go well, right on. Fishing Planet Vids today. Now I can't get enough of playing it. Z the big hunter. Fantastic, man. I'm glad you're enjoying it. It's a fun game, especially for being free. Are you kidding me? Biggest fish in real life, BZ? Uh, I, you know, honestly, I have no idea. Because I've caught flatheads in the past, but I've never weighed them. Um, so the biggest one I have that I actually have a weight on is my channel cat that I caught in that one video, which was 14 pounds. Um, so, no idea. Other than that, no idea. Can you go look what is in the new pack? What is in the new pack? Um, fishing packs... This Tropic Hunter pack? Um, looks like it's got a 68.3 pound rod. Moderate action there, 66.8 pound reel there. A little boat, some uh, 66 pound line, 63 pound line, some sinkers, some hooks, some, uh, some native bugs there, and some native fish. Pretty cool, some fruit. Go for that, uh, Paku, I think it's called. But yeah. Got some stuff and a pond pass for seven days. Not too shabby. Okay, let me show you what I've got here. We've got a bottom feeder rod with shiners on it, and we've got a float rod with shiners on it. And then uh, then we have a popper rod to just catch whatever we can get, I guess. And uh, hoping to make some moolah so that we can uh, move on to a bigger rod and reel and, uh, and catch some more fish is the is the is the goal anyway so anyway we are going to uh st croix <clears throat> i was as good at duck hunting as that dog is i know he's amazing bjorn is the best duck hunter <laughs> um let's see i think we're gonna start over here gonna start over here fifty dollars yeah i know I know it was. It just didn't show up in the alert for some reason. Get old man crow to cough up a few dollars. I know. She's over here like... Like, uh... And I... <laughs> I can't even think of what his name is. Bob Cratchit. And I'm like Scrooge. No! No more coal, Squish Flint. You'll freeze out here. I want you to go back to work and mod for me. Ha 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 ha. Where are we? Yeah, we're right here. Okay. So... So yeah, let me show you what we're dealing with here. This is a little place here. So you can see lots of people like to fish here. But that corner over there is like the magic corner. And so you have to figure out how to fish that corner, basically. It's a magic corner. Is the new pack only for PC? I honestly don't know, Mikey Halliday. Two people disliked the live. Oh, no. That's it. We're ending the stream. Two people disliked it. I don't care. As long as there are people watching and enjoying it, then we're just gonna keep going on, man. Because that's what it's all about. Okay, we got a shiner here. Look at this guy. Woo, woo, wow. How you like that, bud? All right, get you nice and lively. Look at him flapping around. You're gonna get us a big, big old pike, and I, I can already feel it. So we'll uh, throw this out here. Curse splash. Put it in the uh, rod holder here. And then with this one, we're gonna, because it has a float, we're gonna have to throw it into a little visible area. Let's, um, I, I have no idea. Over here, maybe. 
hope for the best. Chris Splash. Still can't really see it, but just gonna have to go with it. Just hope for the best. Because <laughs> I could barely see that thing. <laughs> Did not see Bolivia on Xbox today, so I think it's only out for PC right now. Okay. I get ya. What fish are here again? Musky, pike, walleye, smallmouth bass, uh, golly, rock bass. There, there are a lot of fish here, honestly. Um, blue cats. Um, yeah, just a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. This is my favorite stream on YouTube. Dylan Roaster, thanks, man. Means a lot. Whoa, zooming in way far. I remember popping for for uh, tarpon. At least I can see my bobber now. <laughs> We're just gonna have to keep doing this that way we can actually see our our bobber. It's such a foggy day, I can hardly see it. Watching on his phone, but he can't sign into YouTube. Oh no! Well, say hi to Caden for me. Your your dog is watching the stream too. Well, right on, man. What setup should I use for blue cats? You know, honestly, just just a, a strongest pull that you can get. Ooh. Oh golly. Oh golly. Can't see my meters right now. So foggy. Ooh. Is it gonna work? I think it is gonna work. Oh, that is stressing it to the max, isn't it? Think we got a, a blue cat here? <laughs> Goodness gracious. thing is that our other rod could go down at any moment in fact I don't even see the bobber right now so it honestly could have a fish on it as well and I just can't do anything about it I've doubled up right now diamonds are rares or something so hopefully Hopefully that circle hook is just doing us wonders on that other rod. <laughs> and that fish isn't going to let go. Caden Carpenter, how's it going? Did he try? No, Clayton. Don't ask. Rodney A, how's it going? I didn't see that thing that you were the one that said Caden. <laughs> oh god, look at our other rod. Look at it bending. It is bending way over. That bobber is just going everywhere right now. You see it? In the background? Just, just freaking going. <laughs> Golly. That poor bobber. This is a decent fish, but I don't know how much we're going to be able to look at it just because we got another fish on the other line. Oh, it's a musky, I think. Yeah, a decent musky. Ah, oh, you're kidding me. Literally just grabbed the pole. Dang it. Bruce Barr, do you like to eat fish? I like fish, man. Do you like fish sticks? Do you like fish sticks? Then you must be, must be a gay fish. You know, you know that one. Good old South Park. <laughs> it's 
Timothy, hey, how's it going? Okay, okay. Throw that out there. Got our first musky. That's all right, huh? Should I get a fishing rod or a fishing stand? Um, do you have a sinker rod or like a bottom feeding rod right now? Because if you don't have one, then there's there's no reason to get a stand, you know? You have a new rod. Is that the float rod? The one with the little bobber on it? I'll well, we catch a stream for a while with football and everything, but what's up? Hey, how's it going there? Casey's Ultimate Outdoor Adventures. Goodness gracious. It's a long name. Devante Greer? Did I say that right? Devante Greer? How's it going, man? Rodney A is going to catch you later. All right, right on. Dawson McDaniel, hey, how's it going? Well, this popper's not getting anything, is it? That bobber's starting to move, though. Sometimes, I, maybe I'm maybe I imagine this, but I like to think that sometimes the bobber starts moving a little bit more when a fish is chasing after it. Got something small on here. Be a small small pike maybe oh yeah gosh darn it new personal record tiger musky 6.392 pounds it is a pretty fish just not you know nothing amazing it's just a regular tiger musky but yeah pretty fish anyway pretty fish anyway This gracious loud boat who would ever make a video about that darn boat yeah, hunting gear hopefully I get my first deer we'll ride on G family all right we're gonna try this oh dang it dang it oh god what are we doing what are we doing nope okay yep okay there put that there <sighs> Okay, we're back. We're gonna try this popper one more time. If we don't get anything, then I think we're gonna switch loaders to something else. Bruce Morris, hey, how's it going? Hollow Crow, I never said hello to you. Oh! stress there it's a cool musky you've never seen that one Ooh. gonna keep it tight enough someone told me to start backing up if we can't keep the tension there we go we did it I don't know if it was that that made it work but it, it seemed to do the trick we kept the fish on <laughs> he's too busy playing the game gosh dang it 
I need to stop playing this game so I can chat with all of you. How many times have you been to St. Croix? This is my second time, I think. I stayed two days the first time I went here, and now this is my second time here. I came more prepared with uh, bottom feeding stuff. But yeah. No celebration music? Why would I want celebration music? We didn't catch any uniques or anything. Fish is chasing the bait. Yes. Riley Junker has confirmed. We have confirmation. Ultimate sport of juggling rods indeed, man. <laughs> what do we think we have here? Pike or musky? What are we looking at? Trophy musky at that new personal record, huh? What do we think about this he nil? Oh look at this musky Very nice there, buddy Very nice indeed You're looking very serious now he nil What do you what do you think about this guy? New personal record new personal record for he nil all right, let's throw it back out here. Catch another one. It's going pretty good for Bruce Moore or Spread Elm. Oh. proud I figured out how to get a crappie on mud water bottom rod who knew well yeah that's awesome man like I said I, I have never like attempted to go after crappie specifically <laughs> anytime I've got a crappie it was just because I was fishing for something else and darn crappie came up and at that point it's just annoying that a crappie came and got it make a video on the new lake all right, let me drop everything I'm working on and do that for you, Timothy. No, I can't fish at the new lakes. I don't know if a lot of you know this, but we'll, we'll bring it up here. Oh, what the heck happened? What the heck happened, man? What are we even on? We are on. What's going on? Oh, I know what's going on. Ah. I was so confused. I've never seen that before. <laughs> Threw me off. But yeah, I don't know if you know this, but like the lakes are tied to levels. You have to be a certain level to fish at certain lakes. And so the newer lakes are in the like high 50s. I'm only level 40. So I can't make a video about a lake that I can't go to. Um, that's just something to remember. If you watch my beginner series and you see what level I am, realize that I can't do a video for another lake that is a higher level than what I am. Does that make sense? Um, when when you think about it, it's 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 pretty easy. Is this gonna be normal? It is normal. Okay. Good. Good. Jerk baits work well for pike and musky. Well, that's good. I wanted to try a popper. Last time I was here, I tried other lures that went underwater. And I, w I didn't do too well. So I figured this time I would try a popper. But it doesn't seem to be doing too well either. 
This is why I came here with a float rod and a bottom rod. Because the last time I came here, I caught very few fish. <laughs> it was a mission for crappie. I got you, bro. I got you, bro. Well, I have a three yacht jerk bait. Though I honestly don't know how to fish a jerk bait. Do we twitch it? What do we what do we do? I've never fished one before. Stop and go. Stop and go. I'm gonna do a twitch at the moment. Maybe we need to do a stop and go. Oh, we got one. Little pike. Seven pound pike for $800. Yes, please. I want to fish over there, but I won't be able to see my lures. <laughs> my bobber, I guess, specifically. What did you miss left at 755? Uh, we shot some more animals, most likely. And, um, and then we switched on over to Fishing Planet. My goodness, this is hard to keep up. The three speed's almost too, too fast. Oh, jeez. What are we going to do? What are we going to do? People said the bobber is so gigantic in this game. It's because I can't see it, man. I can't see it. My poor little eyes. Yeah, three speed must be too fast. Okay, back to two speed. We'll just we'll just uh we'll we'll struggle on two speed. I tr I have trouble keeping it afloat. At least when we twitch it, it keeps it from hitting the bottom. Musky out right here at the freaking <laughs> bank. <laughs> Look at that. Goodness gracious. Can we fish this real quick without losing our bobber? We will see. When is the stream ending, BZ? 9.30, man. 9.30. 9.30. Seven thirty to nine thirty. Looks like a buoy. I understand. <laughs> well, look how I mean, look how far away it is. I can barely see that thing. <laughs> Real people in safety. That's what I'm worried about. I'm worried about this tiger guy falling in off of his nice boat there.
Hey, see you Wednesday, Dylan. Sorry, I'm taking forever to read these. But what's new? What is your biggest blue catfish in the game? Not too big, Timothy. I don't think anyway. We can see. Biggest blue catfish. I mean, already you should know that I've I've gone but a tarpon, uh, a chinook, a lake trout, a black drum, and a red drum are all bigger than my blue cat and a snook. So uh, that should tell you that it's not a very good sized blue cat. Um, but yeah, still. 34 pounds from Quanchian Lake for a beginner series episode that I haven't put out yet. So there you go, sneak peek. Ooh, good reference there, Hollow Crow. I like it. <laughs> the other damn fisherman, that dude fought like crazy. Yeah, it sounds like a good fight. Nine o'clock. I'm so sad. I can't watch the end of the stream. Hey, no big deal, Jeff We will see you on Wednesday, man Yours is 75 pounds. We'll ride on man. Sounds like a good fish Tell you what hasn't been getting a bite these two rods over here. Wow. All these pike that we've been the pike and the muskies we're catching them like freaking 10 feet from the shore Okay, I'm gonna Reel these in because they're not catching any fish right now Can you catch a lake surgeon? You bet I can. I just haven't tried. <laughs> I thought we caught a fish, but it was still my bait. <laughs> oh God. See this map right here. Oh, it's all pretty shallow. Okay. Let's just toss it out then, shall we? Right in the middle. All right, peace out, Jeff Bendick. Have a good one, man. That looks good. Nice and professional. My PB is a 95-pound bluegill. Whoa, man. That's a good one. It's got to be a world record, I think. Oh, God. I told myself to click, but I didn't click. Salmon and rice for a late lunch. That isn't Canadian. She probably just went in her backyard and just picked one up out of the stream in her backyard. Classic Canadians eating salmon and rice for lunch. Is there a way to see what gear belongs together as far as rods, reels, and baits? Um, I'm not sure, man. I mean, you can look at their poundage and, like, kind of realize, like, a 38-pound reel should probably go with around a 38-pound rod, you know, for example. Um, but there's no way to, like, kind of, like, group them together for organization's sake, anyway. Have you ever fished in Alaska? 
I personally haven't in real life. My parents have, but uh, I have in the game. Can eat creek. <laughs> yeah. Every 30 minutes. Oh no. We had a bite. Uh, it must have been our bobber. I wasn't looking. Can you accept my friend request on Steam? Unfortunately not. Um, and this is probably good to just tell everyone. Um, I don't I don't accept friend requests on Steam and Discord. As you can imagine, I get I get friend requests every single day, and I would have hundreds of friends. Um, and every single time anyone does anything, there's just pop-ups, and it's just like honestly, I I'm fine with being your friend on Fishing Planet. That's fine. Um, but not on Steam and not on Discord. Just, it's just too much. <laughs> Can stay up till 10. Okay, well, right on. Right on, man. All right, we need to keep looking this way. That way we don't miss anything. Got a halibut, king... A ling cod and a rockfish. Right on, dude. Comrade Doge. Do you think New Mexico is a state? Yes. Is that a trick question, Jake McCracken? <laughs> Nice. Another one. Another one. Yeah, the jerkbait seems to be doing all right. I like this. Yeah, the trick was that I didn't know about when I first started playing Fishing Planet, and I've said this a lot of times, but, uh, you know, it's just a question that continually pops up, is that to play with people on Xbox, someone on PC would have to download the game via Microsoft Store. I didn't realize this, as uh, Steam is kind of the biggest place to uh, download thing games and stuff like that. So, uh... So yeah, that's what I downloaded it off Steam, you know, like anyone would, not knowing that I wouldn't be able to play with Xbox people. So I can't, I can't play with Xbox players because of that. And uh, experience and stuff doesn't carry over when you download it. So I would have to start over from level one, basically. See y'all Wednesday. Remember, beep, beep. Hey, see you later, Jeep. Hope you had a good Monday, man. Not really sure where to go. I think maybe we should I'm starting to think we should move spots entirely but I don't know for sure a lot of people fishing that one spot right there that must be the spot diamond level 4 female gemsbach will ride on
Is that Bo? Is it? Is it me? What is going on, man? No, I think this is just a fat, a fat fisherman catching, catching these ornery pike. Ornery pike. Ah. Oh, man. You know, the thing is, it, if Zaggy catches wind of this, he's gonna, like, report your channel. <laughs> and then your channel will get deleted. So it's it's best to just, to just change the name before that happens, you know? so I can watch football play Fishing Planet and watch you at the same time. You know, honestly, I've thought the same thing. Um, because... Like, uh, like my brother, he like, I have two screens here, so I can, like, watch everything recording and making sure everything is good. Um, and then I have my screen that I can watch and fish and stuff like that. Um, but it's just... <laughs> I I just can't even... I want another TV up here basically is what I is what would be amazing. That way I could watch a football game or something like that. They're all casting over there. Should we go join all those yahoos over there? Say hi, hope you're well, man. Give Bjorn a hug for me. Hey, will do, Ian Robertson. Will do. 50 bucks if you catch a unique. Oh my goodness. Man. Girl, I guess I should say. <laughs> this isn't Rocket League. You know, it's not Fishing Planet either. I should probably change that. Or it's not uh, the Hunter Call of the Wild. Not sure if it'll change it or not. Do you plan on having an access deer guide? Probably not. I don't know. I mean, I, I've never really enjoyed Parquet Fernando anyway, so I honestly don't even have much of a guide to give. I could scratch one together and just kind of make it up as I go if I really was like hurting for views. And you might see that. You might see people put out a guide and then watch it and wonder why you watched it. And it's just... Guides are like such a way to just get people to watch your stuff. It's it's crazy. So you're all fishing over here, huh? This is the special spot, huh? I see you. I see you. Okay. Okay. All right. Well, I'm here now and I'll teach you all how to fish. How about that? Zag is back. Finish class and going to start working on some homework. Finding the why. Revitalize my passion and leadership. Ooh. Well, that sounds good.
Okay, so I'm going to throw out this bottom feeder rod. I guess this is the spot to do it. Not going to be able to see this float, so that's great. But we'll throw it down all the same. And now we'll see what we can get on this. Any good mobile fishing games? Not that I've seen. I, I started playing fishing class just to see what it was about, but it was terribly. It was bad. Bad game. You just you just click the button to like send it out and you get a fish every time. It's not it's not fishing. <laughs> It's like when you played those those uh, those games as a kid where you like threw the fishing line over the wall and then they like hooked a prize onto it. Like that's what those mobile fishing games are like. Jenner the Outdoorsman, how's it going? We got a little pike here. Nine pounder, nine pounder. That grass though, I know, really makes for a fun stream, doesn't it? Really makes for a fun stream. Ooh, this is a snag, it is a snag. I was going to say. Cole Starkey! How's the stream been? Can't complain, man. We've, uh, we've shot some things. We've caught some things. It's been a good stream. Yeah. I'll certainly have to go for them at some point, Hendry. Has King Bjorn made an appearance that he's been in meetings all night and I might need to pull him. He's he hasn't pressed the emergency help me button yet. That's because King Bjorn can uh he can handle his own. You know, he doesn't he doesn't always need guards there for him. Jeez, some deep stuff there, Comrade Doge. All hail King Bjorn. I hear him scratching on the floor. At least we haven't caught one on the bobber. Got another ornery, ornery musky here. Oh, we got a good northern pike. Well, oh, it's only eight pounds. Are you serious? Oh god, come on. Bobby in Valencia, how's it going? I am responsible for sure he is seen by each of his clients. Don't underpay my role in this organization. Well, PR manager, you have 13 minutes. If you were going to show, if you were going to show Bjorn, time is running low, man. A 
A trophy Northern Pike this time around, $1,400. That's what I like to see, man. <laughs> Hold for, for an explanation point, but it does slash. But it does slash. But it does slash. Catch a sturgeon, man. I don't know if I have the stuff to catch a sturgeon, unfortunately. Making quick work of this dude, though. Catch a river dolphin. There, there, there. That's what I want to hear. I don't know why I don't, no one asks me to catch like a hippocampus or or Nessie. Oh god, we've doubled up. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold please. Hold please. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, bring it up. Come on. Jeez Louise. Did it bring, could it have brought up that musky any slower? <laughs> A diamond trophy lodge. So sounds good, Sharon. You'll get in next time, by golly. This seems like a pretty decent fish. Oh, golly. I hear the royal horns sounding, but at the same time, we have a, we have a pretty decent fish on the line. Or the Velociraptor. Or the Velociraptor. The Mosasaur. Plesiosaur. Plesiosaur, please. We'll be fishing for the Plesiosaur today. Had to help my friend because he just got called a wild. Well, right on, Smash Traff. That's awesome. I caught 211 Erpaima. Do you mean you've caught 211 Arapaima or 211 pound Arapaima? Which one? This must be a pretty decent fish. Got a one pound bluegill today. Well, right on. In real life or in the game? You really have to add real life or in the game on the end because I honestly have no idea. <laughs> what is the fisherman for fishing planet? Is it a whole game or is it a DLC 60% off right now and don't know if I should get it? Do not get it. The fishermen. So the people behind Hunting Simulator 2 packaged fishing planet into a game and called it fisherman. The, the fisherman. No, man. It's a it's a big one. It's a PB. <laughs> Twenty thousand XP fish on the new map. I think I might have saw the title for that one, but I didn't click on it. Some comrade Doge says, "Guess what, Zach?" Does a bear live in the woods? Hold on, Doge. That is your answer on seeing the king. Ah. Uh, not in the ha -ha. woods of Kansas? Oh, ha -ha. How dare Sif? You saith, thou saith that. Uh, oh my god. Else? Do you need to record this? No. Just tell me to shut up and I will. No, it should be okay. <laughs> Just a decent, All right, just Doge. decent fish. What's up, Doge? I'm sure it's like a trophy muskie and nothing. 
Nothing amazing. Oh, it was good. Yes, it was. 170, 75 now. You look so alike. Bjorn and Zach? Eh, who said that? Me? Maybe if I turn. I... <sighs> Is he your brother? Yes, indeed. There we go. He's coming in now. He's coming in, Bjorn. He's coming in, Bjorn. He's coming in. I don't have treats in my hand, dude. Hey, treat. Brenton. Aww. You should have an aw button on the soundboard. <laughs> aw. <laughs> can you make stickers for Discord, please? I mean, you can, but I probably won't use them, to be honest. <laughs> 30! 25, 20! He's given up all hope on running away. What is it? It's a pike. It is a, it's a unique pike! Someone owes you 50 bucks. That's right! Someone said that they'd give me 50 bucks if I caught a unique. <laughs> Megan said that. No, Megan didn't say that. <laughs> 4,005. Oh, oh, sorry, we have to be on this one. This is definitely, I think it is. Like, shouldn't it say personal best? Yeah, it, it, well, did it? I don't know. No, that is a giant fish. That's about as big as my carp. <laughs> Holy schmoly, man. That's a solid fish. 51.27 inches. It's 51.27 inches. That's nine. Nine inches short of a uh, six, eight. My feet, sorry, my math's off. <laughs> All right, we'll, um... Getting some, getting some good picks here. Ah, uh, stop turning. Gotta get some for the Instagram. No. No. Oh. Alright, should be good, I think. Top notch, everyone. Well, uh, yeah, let's see this. What do we got here, Zachary? Me. Me. What more what could you more ask could for? What you want? <laughs> no. I pulled Bjorn out of his meetings. <laughs> what are you doing, King Bjorn? Ooh. Ow. Stepped right on my foot. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> ah! He is uh, aggressive. He is aggressive. He's been waiting for these treats all night long. Yeah. So if if you don't know this, this is a this is a little fun fact about Norwegian elk hounds. There's only there's only a few different dogs that have them. Um, what is the one? The big big fluffer dog that's like a husky, but bigger. Golden one? No, it's it's like Tinka. Tinka waits. I can't think of what it's freaking. The uh, it's on the tip of my tongue. It's like it's like a husky, but it, but it's bigger, and I can't think of the darn name at the moment. Mastiff. Malamute. That's it. Not mastiff. Malamute. Is it Malamute? They're the big fluffy ones. Okay, maybe it is Malamute. Okay, that was just was not coming to me. Yeah, that's Malamute. So so somehow Malamutes and Bjorn are related, and uh, they have retractable claws. And so they'll they'll be like they'll be curled up and then um, they can like reach they retract claws like a cat basically and so that so anytime Bjorn ever wants anything his claws will just come out and and lash onto you or your belt or, or your, your watch belt, or, or your, your face <laughs> or your neck your shirt <laughs> yeah. Terry. He is hairy dog. He's hairy doing dog. his his summer shedding right now. Harry Trotter. Harry Trotter. Harry Borker. Harry Borker. Yep. All right. All right. I'll let you get to it. Okay. 
Say bye, Born. Say bye, Born. Bye, Born. Bye, Born. <laughs> I got you done. Okay. Have fun. <laughs> On to the next meet. Golly, man. Ice Hair everywhere. Store. The ice cream storm. Dude. That sounds amazing. Well, I tell you what, everyone, it's 928. There's not much more we're going to be able to do here, but we did get a unique northern pike, which is the best I've caught. Um, definitely going to be up there. 39 pounds. I was sure it was going to be a muskie. Let me, uh, it helps if I go back to the game so you can actually see it. <laughs> 39 pound unique northern pike. My best here at uh, St. Croix, and we're just going to keep on going because there's other big fish that I want to catch as well. But this was a uh, this was a surprise for sure. Glad you made it for a full eight minutes, and you and you saw Bjorn. How awesome is that? Which rec which edition do you recommend getting? Man, I have no idea. I guess the full edition, uh, the one with all with everything in it. <laughs> Ian Robertson is out. All right. Hunter Hold today you got two albinos and one mythical alcohol. Well, that's awesome, man. Back for the last minute. Jeff Bendick is back for the last minute. Caught this unique northern pike. Got a glimpse of it anyway. Oh my gosh, and a floating rod in the air. Wizardry. Wizardry. Harry. Um, but yeah, pretty awesome. I think so anyway. Um, yeah. Can't complain about that. But uh, that's gonna probably uh, that's gonna probably wrap it up, everyone. It's it's uh, 9:29, close enough to 9:30, and uh, I don't think we're gonna catch another big fish in in a minute's time. So I uh, think we might just end it here. Um, thank you all for watching. Really appreciate it, and uh, we'll we'll see you on Wednesday for more Fishing Planet. Not a half and half, you know. Uh, Squish, enjoy your last night away from work. You've been a huge help. Um, hope everyone says nice words about Squish in the chat. Um, but yeah, we'll see you all next time, everyone. Landito. See you next, next, next time on Wednesday, everyone. But as always, we're one planet, one family. Game on.